That kind of looks like the battle pass. Yeah, I was gonna say that looks like the battle pass. Doesn't look like the battle pass. Definitely a battle pass. That should look like the battle pass. That's, That's what, what I'm saying. saying. Google, show me this guy's balls. Whoa! Somehow not dying, we found ourselves washed up on a beach with one mission. We gotta get that goddamn worm out of our goddamn head. Now, just because I probably have dirt for brains doesn't mean there should be a worm in it! Now, just because I probably have dirt for brains doesn't mean there should be a worm in it! These motherfuckers are stealing from me! What the fuck? Come back here, you bitch! Uh, you just missed that kid completely. Come back here. Where um, the fuck's that kid going? Come here! It's going to the hole! It's going to the hole! And after administering some better late than never birth control... <laughs> <sighs> Lovely. We were on our way. Better late than never, birth control. <sighs> Lovely. Now, in a turn of events I hadn't considered, kids can tell adults when you do things like this. And adults can tell the law. And the law can send you to jail. Gal, Gal, you, Tal, Tal, I know you're in there, Tal. What's happening to you, Gal? Oh my god, Tal, what the hell? Oh. I'm out of character. That was fucking awesome! Gave him a replacement eye that saw invisible creatures. Okay, cool. So I make a deal with a hag, and I have disadvantage on perception forever, but you let a random man literally cave your head in with an ice pick, and you get superpowers! Yeah, I'm chill, I'm chill, I'm so chill. It's fine, it's fine. Totally cool. Just look at give me a give me a You get superpowers! Yeah, I'm chill, I'm chill, I'm so chill. It's fine, it's fine. Totally cool. Okay, here's the plan, everyone. This is our last job together, so we had to make sure it goes off without a hitch, you dig? Now, we've already cased the joint, and I've noticed that the clerk seems a little bit stressed about something. That's our way in right there. I'll approach the clerk and hit them with my squid fucker riz to gain their trust. Shit. Okay, plan B. We all disguise ourselves as gnomish triplets. Trip, slip, and grip. Then we'll just walk through the front door and- Oh no! They've recognized us! Turns out we all look exactly like I, Clip do! My wanted posters are all over this bank! What a horrendous oversight! Wrong. Now that we have the guards' attention and they've surrounded us, Ziv can create a black hole in the center of the bank, pulling everyone toward it and within range for a confusion spell to make things go a little crazy. Meanwhile, Tal and I will walk through the gate towards the lower level of the bank and begin shoving all manners of chests into his infinitely huge pockets. But does the heist end here? Oh, no, it doesn't. Ziv, once you rejoin us in the basement, we'll magically lock the gate behind you using Arcane Lock. And then, we'll drink this mysterious liquid given to me by a strange man just outside, making us invisible to the naked eye as we sneak down towards the vault. Once there, we'll need three things. A one-time code sent directly to the manager's brain by a sending spell. A key only the manager has. And a handprint scan from the manager himself. Thankfully, I have all three of those things right here. For I've spent the last 15 years and the entirety of our adventure bouncing being a hero beloved by all and also being a manager at this facility. We're in, but the heist still doesn't end here. Oh no, it doesn't. For further in this vault is yet another vault. This one locked by an electrical circuit requiring code. To this end, I brought our strange cow friend to chew on the wires. So all we'll have to do is spill some water and the door will slide right on open. <laughs> but oh no, the Absolute is here, robbing the very same bank we are at the exact same time. How could this happen? I would be worried if I had not planted the idea in there head using my powers as a true soul exactly one year ago. We'll fend them off for the bank, but they'll get away with the 10,000 gold that was in the true main vault. But that's okay though, because the real treasure is in the lockboxes. And at this point, the owner of the counting house, Rakath Glitterbeard, will be so mentally and physically exhausted that he'll provide no resistance to us picking the locks of each one and taking the contents inside. And with that, we're rich. Grizzly, do you want to just make in-character gobbling sounds with me? Like, <laughs> I'm off it. Come back here, little guy. <laughs> Give me no fucking weapon in my mouth. I want the worms. I want the worms. <laughs> um, and then clip. Uh, how would you react to that situation? No, 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 no,
No worms. No worms. No, put it down. No, get that out of your out of your mouth. Ziv, no, not you two. Come on. Okay, let's all do it at the exact same time. So, hey, what are you guys doing with the No, don't. No, 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 Editor's note here, just put rye like mouth to the floor vacuuming worms. <laughs> no! No worms! Hey, what are you guys doing with no, 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 Zip, no, not you two, come on! Why is it so easy, Bab? 